you wear makeup under your mask or not? I would love to hear that. Clap your hands and you feel stronger. Albertsons. got at Albertson. So, all right, Don, how much was the Avalanche beer? Let's do that first. Normally $9 yeah, a six-pack. It's normally $9 a six-pack, but if you bought three six-packs, you got a dollar off each, each six-pack, six so you saved three dollars. So, of course, we're bargain shoppers, so there you are. And um, so then uh, we got some of this 2% uh, sentence milk, the almond Breeze uh, unsweetened vanilla. This is what I drink most of the time. I was just, I, these sounded good. So we haven't been able to go out and get good fish and chips lately. And we do like to go out for really good fish and chips. And uh, yeah, so we got these, not, not super healthy, um, sure, with all the breading, but uh, every now and then, you know, gotta have, I just, I really do like beer batter uh, uh, fish like this. So then we got um, two of the um, Lou Seren uh, salted sweet cream butter. And these are the 16 ounce, uh, it's the one pound each. So two pounds total. And then I got um, for a, uh, a treat, there's four in a pack. And I got these, um, the So Delicious Dairy Free Dipped Salted Caramel. Uh, ice cream so I'm gonna give those a shot I don't know that I've I think I've had them but it's been a while and then I got the um, just the the sandwiches the vanilla bean they're a little on the pricey side they're like four dollars and something a box which makes them well this one has eight but I'm sure they're really tiny um, really tiny um, sandwiches so probably more like four of the regular size and you're talking over a dollar for each ice cream bar but it's a nice treat. And then I got some of the Pete's uh, Major Dickens uh, or Dickinson's blend, the dark roast coffee. John really likes this. 
And this is John Shampoo, and I tried to get it at Walmart the other day, and they were sold out. And they had them buy one, get one 50% off at Albertsons. So it's a Tresemme restyled uh, for the planet. Uh, anyway, it's, he really likes this. It's the coconut and aloe vera, uh, and it's it's really good. He's been using that for quite a while, and he does have great hair. <laughs> um, I got my sweet cream, sugar-free sweet cream. I didn't get his because he had plenty still. And then, all right, we did get a Hershey bar. It, actually, John snuck that in the, bas the basket. <laughs> so, uh, oh, there's another one hiding. Got two of those, the king size. Sometimes we do break those off and just munch, like have, like a, we'll split a half of a bar or something like that every now and then. And I love these. Uh, it's Lenny and Larry's uh, Complete Cookie Chocolate Chip. I got one of these. I haven't had one in a while, but I'm really getting back on track with uh, just trying to watch what I'm eating a little bit more. <laughs> you wouldn't know it from some of this stuff, but. Um, and then we got some of the, um, well, the, the um, well, these are the, John got these, the Wisconsin Fresh Gouda, uh, the, uh, sti the cheese sticks, and then he got some of the, uh, it's the extra sharp ye uh, yellow cheese sticks, and we like the Cracker Barrel brand, we like this one too, but, uh, you know, I think I I do think Cracker Bell is one of my favorite brands of cheese sticks. So oh, and then we did get some of the um, st we got steaks for tonight, and these are the um, the flat iron steaks. John bought those a while back, and they actually were really really good, and they were on sale. So we bought two packs of them, and we're just going to cook them all up, and have uh, have those for dinner tonight uh, steaks, and then. Uh, the leftovers will probably make uh, fajitas for leftovers. So that's what we got at Albertsons, and I'm going to show you really quick what we got at Lowe's. So here's what we got at Lowe's. We picked up some of the Nature's Way uh, bamboo paper towels. I really like bamboo paper towels, especially when I have a lot of cleaning to do. Uh, so yeah, I'll be using that. Um, there and and really just after we did the the floor project we're still cleaning you know just cleaning everything and dusting really well um i got some of the mini wax wood finish solid color stain john's using this to paint uh, just a couple of areas uh it is in the classic gray number 271 and then i got some lysol all purpose cleaner which we've had a hard time finding uh, at walmart lately i got some more blue painters tape and uh, a wire brush because my friend who recommended um, the paintbrush that I, I, want, I was going to use for the baseboards, if you guys remember that vlog, um, said make sure you get a really good wire brush to use to clean your paintbrush. So I did that and I got the wrong paintbrush before. So uh, I, 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 he, I went over to get some eggs the other day from, uh, from them because they, their family has hens and I go over there and get my fresh eggs and turns out I got the wrong paintbrush. So this is the paintbrush and it's the uh, medium stiff nylon polyester and it's for all paints and stains in the two inch, not the two and a half that I bought before. It was a little cheaper, so I actually got a dollar something back. This was only $11 and something versus uh, I think $12 and something. So anyway, guys, I got the wrong paintbrush, it turns out. So this one uh, is the one he, he recommended and I double checked, I know it's the right one. So yeah. And then John got some of the clear silicone um, for some stuff he's doing. He's working on camper stuff and just things, all kinds of projects. And then I got some of the Dawn uh, Power Wash. I like this stuff a lot. I've been buying it at Sam's Club, uh, but uh, I'm on my last bottle, and I really haven't been to Sam's Club in a while. So while we were out, I just tried to pick up a, uh, you know, some things that I, I knew that I wanted, like the the Dawn and the Lysol cleaner. So uh, yeah, this stuff's really great. We have uh, we keep it in the camper and in our kitchen. And it's, it just works so well for washing uh, glasses. We, we use it on our wine glasses a lot, things that you don't want to put in the dishwasher. And you just spray and um, uh, wipe, you rinse it, and it works so, so well. So really like this stuff. Let me know in the comments if you guys are using this and what do you think. We weren't really uh, planning to go out and uh, go to the store today, but 
that beer was on sale, the steaks were on sale, and I had to return that paintbrush. So it all worked out really well. So yeah, if you don't have your receipt and you wanna return something at Lowe's, apparently you, they can look it up on your card. I think a lot of stores are like that now, including, I know Walmart's like that. In the pickup, when I wanna return something, it's really easy to do that because uh, they have a record of it when you use your card. Now, if you use cash, I don't know how that works, um, but anyway. So, uh, yeah, and then when we were getting ready to go, John made the comment, wow, it didn't take you as long to get ready this time. And I said, well, no, because I'm not wearing the makeup I usually do, uh, because I'm gonna have to wear a mask anyway. So, I guess that's one of the, one small little victory is that we're saving money on makeup, because we're cover we're not having to wear makeup under that mask. At least I am. I'm not uh, not wearing the makeup I used to. So, all right. And plus, it just gets the mask dirty anyway. So, all right, guys. I hope you're having a great weekend. Let me know in the comments. Do you wear makeup under your mask or not? I would love to hear that. Don't forget to subscribe before you go. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye.